Hey, we're in the kitchen today learning about how you can pack a ton of flavor into a healthy winter salad Copy. that also pairs great with local beer. We have Chris McDowell with Beer Musings PDX. So you're a blogger, you write all about this stuff, and you've prepared a delicious salad that will pair with beer. I guess I think of, you know, often salads with maybe a white wine. I don't think of it with beer often. Uh, yeah, so actually uh, this salad, uh, along the lines of a white, white wine, it mm -hmm. goes um, nicely with a Saison. Nice. Okay. Um, so locally yeah. there is um, Level, which is a new brewery Level in beers. Northeast. Okay. And they kind of play on that uh, Nintendo look. Dry hopped Saison. What's a Saison exactly? Uh, so it's a Belgian style of beer. Um, it's lightly fruity, flavorful, and does pair well with probably the same things that you would think of pairing a white wine with. Oh, interesting. Okay, great. Well, this all, all the ingredients look delicious. So it's a kind of a winter salad. Is it like heartier? You can make it as hearty as you want. So it's, um, it starts with um, romaine lettuce, which is one of your heartier lettuces. Mm -hmm. This isn't going to be one of those that you're going to put in there and wilt. And then uh, red cabbage. Yum. They're looking great at the farmer's yeah, market now. Yeah, that looks beautiful right now. Wow. And then pizzazz apples. Um, this is a newer apple variety. It's, pizzazz apple. It's similar to Honeycrisp in its it. texture and flavor. And it comes in a box like this. Where did you find this? Well, mine comes in Your, a box. Yours comes in a box. It's you might be able pizzazz. to get it in a box, too. <laughs> what does that taste? Honeycrisp, you said? Honeycrisp, a... yep. Um, and you can find them locally. Uh, QFC, I actually got uh, these at uh, Sheridan okay. Fruit Market in hmm. Southeast. So you've got, you know, three hearty things right here. And then you just mix up a quick three ingredient vinaigrette. But you have a secret ingredient in here. So what's in here? <laughs> so we have red wine vinegar and we have olive oil and then I have some local barrel aged honey. Adding honey, I never would have thought of that. So you nice can, little vinaigrette mix. Yeah, you can whisk it or if you have one of these handy dandies, you just shake that up. Okay. And drizzle this on your salad. And I bet that honey over the apple gives it a nice little pop of flavor as well. It definitely does. It adds some extra sweetness there. Give that a little toss in there. Oh, it smells great. And then always salt and pepper your salads. It really makes a huge difference. What kind of salt do you use, by the way? Uh, like sea salt, any salt? Kosher salt. Kosher salt. Okay. Yeah, if you want to have fun, grab some Jacobson, some of their flavors, okay. flavored salts. And then pomegranate, the edible Ooh. part of the pomegranate. You can buy a pomegranate mm -hmm. or you can just buy these wonderful containers that did all the work for Easy. you. Easy, you don't have to pick them out. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the salad as it is. If you want to make it more hearty, you could do some rotisserie chicken in there, or I found that I like some freshly grated mozzarella. Yum, can I have a little there. bite? We're yeah, absolutely, this dig in. I'm just gonna go right out of the bowl here. Chris, we're absolutely. gonna put this on our Portland Today Facebook page. I give it a thumbs up. I love it. Your website? with your blog one more time. That is Beer Musings PDX. Chris McDowell, thank you so much. We'll be back after this. I'm gonna eat some more. Thank you. That's delicious.